<laughs> Where have you been? Take three. Take three. That's what it is. So you got the master tape, remote beep beep, and then the camera will come to me where I have to repeat the line, and then I do that, and then they would take the other person that I was talking to, and they would have to repeat the line, and then you would get the master, and you would put it together. So say hi to Greg Ambrosio. Greg Ambrosio, a man like you, I'm telling you, there's no future except hanging with the gear. Herba Rubenfein. Who? Herba Rubenfein. Herba. Bobby Wilson. Hold it. Bobby, Bobby, I just spoke about you. I said you're one of the greatest talents in the country. I said everybody at the Golden Nugget, the deposit is back. I know we're going to get the deposit back. Tell the Dakota band, don't worry about a thing. We're in show business, and I know when it gets good, we're going to get the deposit back. <laughs> All right, so we're good. We're up. We're up. We're good now. Yeah, we're good. So I have no idea what happened, but I was talking with people with this cockamamie camera, and all of a sudden someone said, "We're not getting it." All the years of my career, I never got what I'm doing. <laughs> so why should this be a little different? But uh, modern technology, and I don't know if when I said to you, I hate it. I'm a one-on-one -on -one guy. I hate well, now's everyone's time to get one on one with you. One on one. Now you're getting one on one with No music. music. No music. Gabriel Ben. Gabriel. For an Lauderdale. angel. An angel. Gabriel. My man, he said. My man. Archangel Gabriel. Go ahead. What's Gabriel want to know? Uh, there are a lot of people just giving like hugs and thumbs up and likes, just Gabriel saying hello. What I want. Well, how can Gabriel not like? He's an archangel. You understand what I'm saying? I'm very close. I've always believed if you read my book, that I've always had a guardian angel watching over me because I always did what I felt uh, I wanted to do. And I learned from making the mistakes. But there was always the guardian angel that said, okay, get that way. <laughs> if you read the book, you'll understand what I'm saying. Annie, okay. I got you, Annie. Annie wants to know, how do I stay? How do I stay in shape? I think I told you. I eat well, I exercise, thank goodness that the gyms are open. In the morning I told you I do my little exercises, the stomach thing, ba -ba 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 -ba. and listen, at the age of 80, I'm no different than anybody. I got aches and pains, so I got to work it out. So I get up, I do that, I ride the bike, and I go to the gym. And I watch what I eat. I eat the, Basically one meal a day, uh, and maybe about 5, 5.30 with the guys. you got a whole bunch of guys we can get. If Avalon were living here, he'd be hanging with me. Rydell hangs with me occasionally. When Frankie's in town, we, we hang out. And Frankie Valley, that is. And we, uh, we're in show business. If I don't look good, why would you even want to come and see me? My, my success depends upon you people saying, hey, maybe I'm an inspiration. 80 years old? Wow. That's, that's what it is. But that's what entertainment is about. And that's why I know I got to take care of myself for you people. I bop and I dance and I move and I boogaloo and I, I create. It's because you take care of yourself. Right, Bobby Wilson? <laughs> All right. Another question coming your way? Yes. Another question. Fellow DJ, DJ Ryan Dorner. DJ Ryan. WBTL 92.1. 92.1. I'm on that station. Have yeah. you ever thought about creating your own internet station so the great music you play can be heard 24-7? Have so I? So many radio stations are killing this great music. Well, there's no longer radio. Not, not the way I did. And, and uh, me creating an internet I hate this modern technology. Very devastating news. Uh, the legend Jerry Blavat, um, the DJ, the popular legendary DJ from US has reportedly passed away. Jerry Blavat's family have come out to release an emotional and heartbreaking statement announcing his death 
via his official Facebook. According to the statement, it read, on behalf of our family, we would like to thank all of you, Jerry's friends from near and far, for the outpouring of prayers, love, support, respect, acknowledgement, and appreciation for what he meant to all of you, especially in such a very, very difficult time for our family. We know how much he was loved by you, his loyal fans, his friends, and we know the Gita will live on in our hearts forever. But for us, our grief is truly indescribable in losing the man who will forever call daddy. The statement further continued and said, Jerry passed away from myasthenia gravis and related health issues at Vitas Impatient Hospice at Jefferson Methodist Hospital this morning. Jerry proudly said in one of his last moments that life is precious and I'm happy and when I'm happy, I want to the, I want the world to be happy. So he lived life to the fullest and enjoyed sharing life with all of you. His love for Philadelphia only superseded his love of music. He was proud of his great city and nothing made him prouder than the impact he, the music from Philadelphia made on the world. Jerry wished for a big celebration of life and a one big one is planned and all our and you all will come will gather on saturday january 28th at the cathedral basilica of saints peter and paul that is uh, the rest street in philadelphia a viewing will begin at around 9 a.m with a mass scheduled at around 11 30 AM. So that was the statement that was released by the family after the, do the death and the unexpected death of the legend Jerry. The continent's father sh said that please continue to share your memories of Jerry and we are enjoying them. He loved all of you. So the statement was concluded by um, A.D. Emeros who actually represented part of the family. So we all know Gerard Joseph de Blavat was born in around July 3rd, 1940 in South Philadelphia and passed away on July on January 20th, 2023 from effects of myasthenia gravis and related health issues at the Vitas Impatient Hospice at Jefferson Methodist Hospital, like I earlier told you. Jerry Blavat was, however, uh, the getter of the getter with the heater, uh, the boss with the hot, hot sauce, and was born the day he got behind the microphone at the Camden's Wickham in around 1960. Regaling young area audiences with his first putter and his devotion to rhythm, blues, and rock and roll. Since then, Jerry Blavat has become a Philadelphia icon, a music encyclopedia, and a rock and roll Hall of Fame inductee and a best selling author. A concert promoter, a nightclub owner, a father, a man known for snapping his fingers with a click louder than Costanets and his exclamation, my man. Blavat's voice and the legend will never die and the world will continue to remember him because he's been such a legend in the entertainment industry, not only in the US but also on the international standards worldwide. So losing such a man is really very heartbreaking and devastating and we will continue to send our messages of condolences, messages of sympathies to the family, the fans and everyone who was really touched by the works of Jerry Blavat. In this exact moment in time, uh, all we can do is to continue praying for the soul of the deceased and all we can say is rest in power the king, Jerry Blavat.